I would like to take this time to thank my subscribers for tuning in. Those who are new to the channel, please smash that subscribe button for further info and updates. Connection TV, the people's choice for hot topics. People's sad news. A mother of three dies after C-19 party. This young lady you see here on the screen is Crystal Jolene. She's only 28 years old. She was at a C-19 party which takes place in Las Cuevas. There was on a party yacht. So she was partying with friends and enjoying herself. When you, you all know we're supposed to be in quarantine. So you're not supposed to be partying. You're not supposed to be outdoor unless it was essential. But there was partying. Celebrating whatever. I don't know. But she was partying and enjoying herself. Now when the party finished and everything is done and on the way home now. She and friends went into this van open bag van so she was in the tray of the van getting the ride back to where she lived in Barataria while some was inside of the vehicle the remainders that couldn't fit in the vehicle resorted to sitting in the tray of the vehicle which we all know sitting in the tray of a vehicle is very dangerous you're not supposed to sit in the back of the tray of an open back vehicle that is for like supplies and stuff like that so they were sitting in the back of the vehicle and on the way from Las Cuevas now the driver is driving and they are claiming that the driver lose control of the vehicle while driving over some gravel on the street so it was some gravel on the street and he driving who knows how much miles he doing per hour how fast he going or how slow he going we don't know most likely he probably was going fast if he went over the gravel and skid so he went over the gravel it skid he lose control of the vehicle and the people that was in the tray of the vehicle fly out of the vehicle some land in a ditch some land on the road this young lady crystal died immediately on the scene from the impact the vehicle crashed the other six people was taken to the hospital port of spain general hospital the police are claiming that the driver could be whole for the death of this young lady due to the fact of reckless driving so the police Stating. So people, this is what I'm trying to tell you. The government is telling you how to stay inside due to the fact of the, the widespread of the C-19 and the epidemic and crisis. But yet still, people are making their way out to do stuff that is not essential. Stuff like party, stuff like hanging out. And this led to the death of this young lady because if this young lady was at home she may have been alive today she went and she sat in the back of that vehicle and she lost her life and look at the screen right now this is a beautiful young lady 28 years old such an angel is just taken away from this earth to another place this young lady lost her life. When she thought her day was going smooth and beautiful while she's partying on the yacht and enjoying herself with her friends and winding up and enjoying herself, which everybody deserves to enjoy themselves at some time in their life. She didn't even know by she making that one mistake of going instead of the back of that tree of the vehicle would have been her last. People, they need to understand at the same time. We don't know if the driver was drunk, but remember this, your party, and he might drink a little liquor. He might have been tipsy. He might have been driving two speed. And if 
you driving with somebody in the tray of a vehicle i believe it's already you're not supposed to do it but if you're doing something like that you're supposed to be driving very cautious and at a very a rate that is not too fast you can be flying down a highway with people in the tray of the vehicle there's no seat belt in the back of the tray of a vehicle so you can't be speeding and flying or either and stuff like that and anybody who know last quavers is if you see them roads to get to last quavers and coming back from last quavers yo those roads are not a joke and guess what she could have been intoxicated as well in the back of the vehicle and couldn't hold on or whatever or was sitting down you know some people instead of sitting in the tray itself they sit on the side holding on to the railing in the back of the thing so when some of these start to zigzag and, and the vehicle start to throw itself all over you can't hold on and even if in the back of the tree i believe anybody will fall out so after she fell and probably hit her head and lost her life so people i'm urging you if you're not if you're going outside please go outside for something essential and don't go out for something unessential and we'll lose your life if you can stay at home until this pass, better yet. But if you go there, be cautious and make wise decisions. Because it's sad to see this young woman, mother of three, gone so soon. And her kids, three kids, is going to have to live with the fact that their mother lost her life. She's only 28 years old. She had so much more living to do. And was just snatched away taken away lost her life and then the sad thing is during this COVID-19 and C-19 epidemic her kids and them may not even be able to attend a funeral because they claim only five people could go to the funeral so if her three kids go some of the family members wouldn't be able to go or either the family members will go and they may not take the kids due to the fact of the sadness or oh, who knows so it's actually a bad time for anything people at Trinidad and Tobago and people of the Caribbean please do wise things and please try to stay away from stuff that could you could lose your life like going in the back of this vehicle is very dangerous I will urge anybody that is going in the back of a vehicle to change their mind and take another vehicle or something. This young lady just lost her life. Thanks for tuning in with Trini Connection TV. Like and subscribe. If you're new to the channel, smash that subscribe button for further info and updates.